Mike Turner here, State Farm Stadium, Cardinals Rams today. Let's see if these Los Angeles fans actually exist. I heard it's a myth. I got a Mark Balger jersey, perennial pro bowler. Immediately earns respect. Come on. What's your favorite thing about Los Angeles? Any kind of restaurant, any country, any sport. They have it there and all that. Yeah, the wrong answer. The actual answer is San Diego. Women! The actual answer is packing up and getting out. Um, Disneyland would be the best. The answer is actually Leonardo DiCaprio. I don't know. Downtown, I guess. Wow. Do you, have you ever been to downtown Los Angeles? Yeah. Fun thing to do there is pack up and get the hell out. That I'm not there anymore, stuck in the traffic. Wow. That actually is accurate. Where are you from in L.A.? I'm not from L.A., from here. Every Rams fan ever. Nobody ever from L.A. We got some parents that have allowed their child to be a Rams fan. How are we feeling about this? He's just as confused as every Rams fan. They've only been there two years. They don't know what's going on. Why at such a young age did you choose the Los Angeles Rams? Because they have so many wins. Well, this guy knows. That's actually the best answer I've ever heard. Do we, is that a Sam Bradford jersey? What does Sam Bradford mean to you? Um, I never heard of him. <laughs> <laughs> well, I used to be uh, with the Rams, then the Cardinals, and then they let him go. That is a beautiful synopsis of Sam Bradford's career. That's a big investment. That's like St. Louis, man. That Perennial Pro Bowler. Been in LA, well, two years maybe. Oh well, this guy got you to a couple playoff games and blew it. He was born a Pro Bowler, all right. He got Bulger. This guy could throw the deep ball. Shout out to Mike Marks. Uh, how long have you been a Los Angeles Rams fan? Uh, since I was nine, so 79. The answer is actually uh, 18 months. What's your favorite part of St. Louis? Down in the Blues area. Wow, that's a hockey team actually. And they don't have that much blues in St. Louis. We got a Russell Wilson jersey, and I just want you to know that 12 months from now, that's going to be a Jared Goff jersey. Kirkland, baby. Kirkland, Washington. Now he's just, I mean, that's Costco. Everybody knows the Costco brand. Go Packers. Here's a, here's a confused guy. We have no cheese. What are you doing here? Well, from my family to use, to yours, R-E-L-A-X. What does that mean? What does that mean? A true fan. A true fan. He doesn't even know sound bites. We got a Browns fan here at a Rams Cardinals game. What what say you? Uh go Brownies. So we just this is really just reiterating that Rams fans are very confused. I'm a glutton for punishment, what can I say? Masochism is real in 2019. Seahawks fan, a Packers fan, now a Browns fan? I told you Rams fans don't exist. Was your favorite quarterback Chris Everett? Uh no. Uh, for, uh, Favorite time when I was a little kid when Jim Everett threw the pass to Flipper Anderson. When Chris he, Everett. It was, it was not Chris Everett. Chris, Chris Everett. Was a tennis player. You ever think LA Rams fans just have to make up memories? Jim Everett pass is the best memory. Chris Everett. Chris Everett's a tennis player. YouTube, Jim Rome, Chris Everett. Yeah, what are your thoughts on Mark Bolger? Yeah, I don't like Mark Bolger. Fun fact Mark Bolger doesn't like himself. Is that what you guys say? Whose house? What are you guys saying? Whose house for? Well, actually, it's the USC Trojans' house. Is that the punter? I think we got the punter's jersey. Hey, look at how ashamed he is. He lost a bet to me, so he has to wear my Johnny Hecker jersey. What's going on, buddy? It was not a very good bet. Uh, this has been Mike Turner here at State Farm Stadium doing some tailgate trolling with the Rams fans. And hey, Cardinals, maybe be better next year, and this would be a lot funner.